Hey there guys and welcome back to Software Inc. with our XT Productions company and uh, I've read through the comments of last episode you guys had quite a bit of good advice and I've taken I think most of it and uh, done a few things off camera so from here it doesn't look like much has changed uh, you may notice so that I added several more printing stations uh, if my math is correct we can now do about 120 some on thousand per month because the uh, printing jobs I guess do give us a ton of money so I do want to try to increase that. Uh, I'm actually not sure where the door is here. Oh, okay. It's, um, I'm like hitting all the wrong buttons. Game, stop it. Um, okay, so actually I did forget pallets though. I think we want, I think that's walkable. Yeah, we want one more pallet there. Uh, so I've done that, but then also I've made a second floor. So it's not like the windows aren't really aligned. It's kind of crappy. This is a very temporary building until we can just make enough money to make a much bigger building. Uh, but I put in one room here and the reason I separated this off is because I may want something different here. But this one here, this is entirely um, support. Uh, there's four people for support. I've hired them. I've made a support team and I've assigned this room to only be support, which uh, I think means that they should come up here all the other desks down below are assigned to people so they should just come up here these aren't assigned to specific people uh so the support should just come up here uh, i put in an elevator for them to get up and uh and yeah so hopefully so then what i've done is i've done that uh but then also i've reassigned this to the support team and taken core team off of it and in addition i've also added one more desk here with another marketer for the core team to try to get the marketing going a little bit better as well so I'm hoping that will kick things off. Uh, we probably could actually take uh, some of these printing jobs. I may want to hire another courier. Um, in fact, yeah, let's do that. So we have a courier coming in in the morning. It may be a decent idea to have another one coming in later, like at night maybe. Um, so, because we have these like deal or not distribution, um, these deals we can take. There's tons and tons of printing jobs. Like this one wants this one's a bit soon. I, I don't think we can get that done in a month. Uh, this one, they're all by December. Uh, so this one, this one would be good. Uh, 352,000 copies by May of next year. I'm pretty confident we could do that. It's 38. Since a copy translates into like $100,000-ish, roughly. Um, so I'm actually going to accept this. And uh, I guess I don't need to really set that because it, it should just do that. So yeah, I can do 126 per month. We should easily be able to do that. And uh, we are trying to market uh, XT Ages. It's not going good. We have zero followers. I'm going to release a press build unless I've done that already, which I might have. Um, so I'm going to speed things up. Uh, we're going here. The uh, support team, I think, should be in, I would imagine, next the next day. Um, same with our new marketer, because I hired them while the game was paused. This is just like not doing anything, which is kind of concerning. Um, this needs to release actually, or this needs to release two months from now. So this is a bit, bit concerning. Um, the t this is not really doing much. Um, this press release, man, is just like crawling. Uh, if you remember last episode, I think I did have a marketer assigned to programming, which A, didn't help the programming, and B, um, I'm actually going to lower the priority on that. I probably should have done that a while ago. Whoops. Um, so we have one more month, October, November, no, we have two more months until this releases. Um, so maybe we can get a press release out. I did release a press build. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and speed up time here a little bit. Uh, hope, there's quite a bit to pick up here. Hopefully these couriers will do that. Uh, we have actually some followers, which is pretty decent. We're writing this pretty quickly. Uh, employees not having their social needs met. I mean, like, I don't know what to tell you, dude. Like, there's a freaking, like, canteen and stuff here. I mean, I don't know what else to tell you. So these guys are working here. They should be working on that. I'll have to see. Um, we do have... Oh, press build has been reviewed. So, we've gotten a test run. XP production is not well known in this market. We haven't really heard about XP Ages. It actually... It's actually looking okay and has all the new features. Sweet. 
Um, so deals, we had these new deals. Um, I wish we could filter it by like new ones. Um, support, 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 print. We could do design jobs. The last ones didn't go so good. I mean, there's more printing. I think these printing jobs are the ones. Yeah, so uh, let's go ahead and see. These guys are working. I don't know where our fourth person is. There they are. So they should be uh, doing that fairly well. We are marketing this. Uh, we could also hype this, I suppose. Uh, like continue hyping it, maybe. Uh, we. I don't know why our couriers are not like these are getting full, dude. Like where, where are the couriers? Is what I would like to know. <laughs> um, this is actually okay. So there we go. This one is coming along fairly slowly, but that's okay. Um, let's go ahead. Let's also hype this. Um, so everyone's leaving. Um, I'm going to release this press release next month. I want it to get a little bit farther before we do that. Um, so this guy is actually almost done. We could review it. Um, that, that, so who what? Would you like to begin the HR tutorial? Um, yeah, let's actually do that. Uh, so the HR, to manage HR settings, open the team window. Yeah, well, you won't let me do it unless I cancel out of this. Peer review, please note the outsourcing will cost um, outsource. So open the teams. Isn't that what it's set to do? HR management. Game. Wait, why is there no option? Oh, do I have to like click a team? Okay, so I think how this works is to enable this, the team leader must have taken a course Okay, so this will like distribute the salaries, handle wages, role selection, whether and how HR control employee role assignment programmer. So we can essentially set like automatically how much, how much um, all this, all these people make. Um, I'm not gonna actually mess with that right now because I, I haven't quite figured it out. I wanted to look at it actually off screen a little bit. Um, I wish like the tutorial hadn't gone away. Um, so this is day two of October. Okay, so actually, um, let's go ahead and do this. Um, this thing is done. I don't know why this is so bad. Maybe we just have bad programmers working on it. I mean, the code units are what they should be. Um, so that's a bit concerning. These, the support team is kind of fixing stuff. There's no more queued, which I guess is really good. Uh, yeah, we can go ahead and release this press release today. So I'm going to do that. We're going to release. Has been released. Uh, target demographic doesn't really know who actually they have already started work on XA and it's, and it's cutting edge. Has some cool videos and it sounds great. Sweet. Um, yeah, like this. I mean, we could promote this. I don't know, man. Like this, I'm I'm sad because the 3D editor I thought was going to be a really good thing to be doing, uh, because there weren't there wasn't one out yet. But we may have had like I think because we had the marketer working on it, which like programming, which was really stupid of me, um, accidentally. That was pretty bad. Um, how are we doing? Actually, we have more deals even. Um, I actually am curious on, well, actually we can look where, so deals, we have this print job per copy, um, distribution in storage per month goal hundred. I mean, yeah, we should easily be able to get that going. Um, hyping, I guess they're just hyping it currently. Yeah, I don't like, I don't know what to tell you dudes, if you're. <laughs> Social needs aren't being met, uh, aside from the fact that you just have an issue. Because, I mean, we have a canteen. The only thing we don't have is, like, team meetings, I guess. Which I did want to kind of do next time. Um, so, it's still November. Uh, we're not losing followers. We could do another press build. Um, although, but yeah, actually, why don't we just release another press build? Uh, because there has been quite a few uh, 
quite a few more bugs fixed in this. So this releases next month, which is fantastic. Uh, this thing is still being bug fixed. I'm gonna actually bump it up a little bit because we have quite a few bugs already fixed here. And then next month we will release XT Ages and see what we can do. I'm gonna release it right in the morning uh, because, there we go. Because uh, I want to start marketing it right away. So let's go ahead and release XT Ages. Um, yes, we want to release it. Yes, we want to start a campaign. We're going to give a budget of, um, let's say, $20,000 core team. Okay. Um, in order, we would want to print copies. Let's go ahead and, well, let's order some. Let's order uh, 50000 and then I don't need the marketing tutorial, thank you. Support work, I mean, I guess we could look at that really quick. Uh, when you release a new piece of software, it will uh, spawn a support work item. Through this work item, you will receive support tickets from your customers, assuming you have any support tickets. Should be answered as quickly as possible. Employees with good programming skills will be able to verify specific bugs quickly. Um, support for um, a product never ends by itself, so you have to end it when you don't think. Okay, so we do still want to support this. Um, and then we also want to, okay, that is assigned to support, perfect. Uh, so we are marketing this. And I'm gonna bump that up above this one a little bit. And this thing is just going kind of slow. I mean, the quality I think is pretty bad. Our programmers just don't seem to be doing very much. This guy, our lead is not doing very much because um, we don't have any team meetings being held, which I suppose I should do. It's stress. Make sure you don't overwork them to too many tasks. You. What's your problem, lady? You only got one thing to do. All you got to do is fix bugs in one program. Like, <laughs> I don't know what the problem is, man. Uh, we got our hands on XC80 from XC Production. It hasn't been that long since we last tried it. It's not well known. Um, okay, sweet. So we'll see what happens there. Uh, and then we do probably want to start printing our own copies. So let's go ahead and go to XT Ages and we're going to start printing. Um, XT Ages, let's uh, set a maximum of, say, 20,000. And then, yeah, I don't know, like, why these people are stressed. Like, they have one thing to do. Like, <laughs> <laughs> the the core team currently has one thing to do. I don't know what the problem is. Um, we'll see if we make any money from XT Ages. Sometimes the first first month like doesn't, and then it does. And I think it's because like the marketing doesn't actually happen. Um, so yeah, we made like thirteen thousand dollars, which is crap. But it hadn't actually been being marketed. Uh, let's go ahead and read our review. Uh, XT Production is a newer cover. Nobody. Knows them in the gaming market. XT8 is overall well-made product. We can't even imagine how complicated this must be behind the scenes, and it feels very stable. It's packed full of art, but it's passable. Um, it will be interesting to see whether it can compare to Army Camp 7 by Stab Trap. Seems the dev left behind some bugs. I mean, we fixed like 300 bugs, dude. Overall, XT8 is looking okay for the price. Okay. Um, we have more things, tons and tons of support. Uh, these print jobs are obviously, oh wait, hold up, April. So here's one, um, we could take this print job. Let's go ahead and accept, so we could take probably both of these. Let's accept that one. And then also accept this one. Per month, 63,000. I don't know why this was cut, like, cut in half. Why is this cut in half? Are some of these machines, like, broken? I don't know. That's a little bit odd. Um, so this didn't get all the way marketed, which is a bit of a concern. Uh, we'll see if we make any money. I didn't... Yeah. So, <laughs> XC8 is pretty much a flop. The only other thing I can think of is if we can port it, potentially, to something. Um, we... Yeah, I'm not gonna really port it to these. These are pretty crap. Um, so yeah, we're not really gonna make much money off of this thing. Uh, we could start something new. 
we are still working on support for X editor. They're just not able to finish the marketing on this, even though I had the priority bumped up. Uh, okay, so luckily we're still making money from print jobs. So this thing is, yeah, pretty crap at the moment. Um, I'm just gonna like... I mean, this is still making decent money, actually. Um, okay, so I think we're going to start marketing this. I want to at least set a release date. Let's release this January, February, March, April, May, June. Let's release this like July of this year. Um, so we're going to do that. And once we get like 200, um, actually, since the marketing team is a bit slow, we may want to do a press release here fairly soon for this thing. Although, well, no, we don't want to do it too soon because, like, if we start getting followers, they'll they'll start dropping. Um, so this thing is pretty crap. Uh, let's see, we have more deals. Support development, not any of those I really want. Um, I'm interested in how much we've done this. Goal, we should be in great shape there. And then, uh, yeah, so I want to start a new program. I'm not quite sure what it's going to be yet. It's called in sick. Okay, we made a little bit more. This thing's still making like 50 grand a month, which, you know, isn't bad. Um, so I am, I am thinking though, let's put this on like normal speed. Uh, maybe that speed. And let's go ahead and develop some software, which I think it pauses anyway. Uh, so, hmm. Actually, normal speed, I want to look at upcoming releases. I, I like to do this before we develop stuff because of competition and such. So what all is available? We can actually do antivirus now, which may be a good thing. Um, if we look here, category, um, so actually there are quite a few antiviruses. This is, maybe it's not good. Um, Damn, they're like beating me to it, man. Operating systems, office software, game, game CMS, 2D editor, a three, 3D editors, um, which actually release April. So I should have changed the release date. That was actually really bad on my part. I should have checked. Um, so we have, there's not audio tools. There are, oh no, there is an audio tool. Although, but that's this year. Like, it's gonna be a while before I, um, before I release that, game engine we could do, we could do a game engine. Audio tool, I feel like it'd still be good, because let's do audio tool, and let's have it do music editor. Didn't we release an audio tool? No, we didn't. We haven't ever released one. So less than a year. Um, pretty decent. Uh, a 2D editor, we could choose X editor, which actually would not be a bad idea considering that's an option, it is. So let's do that. And then let's go ahead and add any operating systems. Um, there's int, this one, this one, 83, that's kind of old. Guess we could do it anyways. That one's way too old. So we're gonna do that. And this should, um, 14 code units, which is not too much at all. Let's go ahead and uh, price-wise, let's do this at like $69.99. Uh, we're gonna just call this, how about, uh, how about like X, X wave. Um, audio tool, boom, 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 done, done. I could put it on hosting. Have code in one place, which reduces bugs and makes your programmers more efficient. I mean, we could put it on hosting. Our, our servers aren't maxed by any means. Um, so let's do that. Let's go ahead and click here to assign the product to a project management task. We haven't ever, we haven't done that at all yet. So let's go ahead and develop this. Uh, putting more people on a product than needed does not necessarily make development faster and might actually decrease effectiveness. So um, if we look here at XT Wave, it requires there's one extra designer, which I don't think is gonna hurt that much. In the programmers, I didn't see how many it needed, but I think we're okay. 
Like we may have one or two extra, but I think what it really means is like putting like 20 on something that only needs three. I think like one extra person or something isn't going to like kill it. Um, XT Ages, I feel like it's just such a flop. It's not even worth like marketing um, at all. Uh, April, March, April. Okay, so we don't quite need to press release this yet. I am interested in a review. Um, peer reviews, okay. Like, I don't know what to do about this. Like, do you guys know, like, how, how am I supposed to fix this? I mean, we have a canteen. The only other possible thing I can think to do is hold, like, team meetings, which we could do. I mean, we have a leader, which you, he usually does nothing. Um, so maybe, maybe we should do that. Maybe we should, like, start holding team meetings or something. I'm not sure. Like, one... It seems like it's just one employee who's just, like, has some major personal issues or something. Uh, so this one by November, this one by December. Um, I'm pretty sure we could accept that pretty easily as well as this one even. Get some more cash flowing in. Uh, we could we could do, like, a little meeting room or something upstairs. I mean, I have these additional this additional space. So maybe that's something we'll do next episode. Uh, I think I'm going to uh, probably end this episode here. I do think we are about at time. So this is not accelerating quite as quickly as I hope, but at the same time, my previous runs were like super easy, um, which I kind of wanted this not to be. There's another one here, but I'm a little bit worried about accepting quite that amount. Um, so this thing is still going audio. Actually, I don't even know actually an interesting point uh, that's not what I wanted I don't actually know if we have programmer artist marketer so design do we even have like audio I mean they're a e decent audio designer they're not I kind of am um, in terms of programmers we have like I mean they're kind of okay at audio um, why don't we take you? Well, why don't we educate someone even more in audio? Why don't we take like you and we're going to educate you programming in audio and we're gonna months, let's send you for like two months and start your education. Just so we have maybe someone a little more competent with the uh, audio programming potentially. Would be good. Uh, but yeah, I think I'm gonna end this episode here, guys. We aren't bankrupt. We are actually earning money. Uh, I mean, this, it's been like several years and X, X editor is still just going. This is like really pissing me off. I don't know like what these people's issue is. Um, actually, these guys are like, can, can I click you? I like a team member, effectiveness, social. Like, I don't know what to tell you. Like, you, you're capable of going down to the canteen and there's other people working in here with you. I don't know, guys. Give me some advice. What do I need to do here for this? I mean, we could just... I think I'll build a little meeting room. Maybe that'll help. I mean, I know they're in a separate room, but, like, how are you... Is, if, if people get so upset about being in separate rooms, how are you supposed to have, like, a huge company? Are you supposed to just have, like, one room the size of an entire city block with, like, people somehow separated? Like, if you don't section off the rooms, how are you going to section off teams and stuff? Like, I don't get it. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not sure what the deal is. Anyway, I'm going to end it here, guys. As always, thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Uh, I think we are making progress. I will be interested in X-Wave if it can do something and X, uh, the 3D editor. But as always, thanks. I look forward to seeing you all next time and do take care.